So we're going to switch the name to Turbo Suit uh, starting, I guess, January 5th. Turbo Suit is basically, we wanted to still stick with the theme of like wacky sweaters or whatever. So we figured like, what is, what is the next step up from a Cosby sweater? And that is a turbo suit. And that's basically an open-ended thing. It can be like a really awesome Armani suit. It can be a Cosby sweater. It can be an astronaut suit. It can be whatever you want it to be. So it's it's basically just an open-ended whatever you thing. Want whatever, it's whatever you want it to be, you know? Turbo suit. He was kind of talking about leveling up the clothing too. And uh, we have a new album coming out within the next couple of months. We don't have an exact date. And we sort of did that with our music too it's like recording wise like we have live drums on it a lot more live instrumentation you know dave just keeps getting better and better at producing it's just going to be our best work yet so i think that kind of yeah we leveled up in every sense of the word so i, I think that's part of it too turbo suit is actually quite a bit different than what kazu sweater was you know so um even though the new thing is like it's a nice way to kind of freshen everything up and officially change over the way the band is now so now we have a totally a different approach to how we do our live thing and thanks to Jeff you know he's always coming up with ideas things that we can do we sound different now because uh, you know he, he came in and, and we changed our approach to stuff so that was you know that was one thing that changed it's more of like a band sound than it is you know than it is a uh, like a DJ sound now which we can still do both things you know what I mean so over time we realized that if I triggered some of those sounds it gave me more control to be more musical and it gave, like we said, a more cohesive sound song to song instead of, you know, tonalities changing in and out. So that's been the biggest change to our uh, live approach since I've joined the band. This time it was write the drum tracks, drummer played his own tracks, and then we rearranged the electronic tracks to go with what he played. So um, it was a more involved approach, which it ended up sounding amazing, you know, it sounds awesome. When I'm soloing, the drums help me build a solo better than any other instrument. So it's kind of cool to be able to build that way with someone instead of just kind of having to like maybe try to do it all myself. You know what I mean? Yeah, on the new record we actually have, um, I think it's like 10 or 11 guests on the record and uh, Prob Cause is one of them. Uh, some of them are like Joel, Joel Cummins is on the record, Jake Sinegar's on the record, Andy Farrig, Natalie Cressman. Marcus Rezac, there's a ton of them, but Prob Cause is uh, somebody that we've seen coming up from Chicago that's just doing an amazing job. And uh, so we asked him to be on a track and he and he did. And he, we sent him the track, he sent it back and he killed it. You know, what better way to make a new video than have him come out and do the track with us. And so yeah, Prob Cause will be here tonight in the house. We're here in Chicago to close out the year and, and do it right and start over fresh in the new year with Turbo Suit. Yo, this that moment you've been waiting for. Everything is good the fuck is you complaining for? Picture me rocking a Coogee with a doobie high Fiji like a movie Grab a Fuji, take a flip, flick a pick and burn a split Just a couple months ago, I ain't know how much it grow I just wanna take this shit be